People ask us every day why we strive to be the best in a game which we can't control, where one single card decides about winning or losing. They say it's a gamble. They say it's just a game. They are not us. We work hard to put the odds in our favor for that one big score, that one huge bluff, that one moment where the sucker kisses his chips goodbye. To us, poker is everything. But thanks for asking. In a day, um, I'm not one of these high rollers. I'm just basically a mid-stakes grinder, but I think it was close to 10k, around 8. I don't remember good, 8, 9k, something like this. Most of one is uh, about 65,000 euros. It deserved it. I worked hard, not got my rewards, and then it just all pops up in one go, and I felt like I you know, felt really good. <laughs> I think the most amount has been probably about 4.5k. That was playing 2, 4, and 3, 6. Yeah, that was my best day. It's really impossible to say how it feels because it's impossible to compare it to anything. I mean, obviously, it's an amazing feeling. Yeah, it's quite a surreal experience, like, winning that much online, I think. It's definitely a good one. I mean, as my friends, I know a lot of them are quite, obviously, a bit, I will not say jealous, but, like, envious, maybe, um, that I can do what I want when I want. Yeah, I, I was a fine student, and even if I was doing really well on that, uh, I, I wouldn't have anywhere near the quality of life that I do from poker just because it's more money in the short term and there's like a lot of risk in going into finance right now so there's like no guarantees. I wouldn't know what my lifestyle compares to before poker. I mean I was obviously a student, I also wasn't uh, well financially. Um, I used to obviously like, you know, look for bargains in like, you know, same things like anyone else, every, any other student did. Before playing poker, my, uh, I was pretty sporty. I went to the gym a lot, played football, played rugby, going out with friends a lot, doing a lot of socialising. They think I've got it really easy. They think I just sit at a computer and click buttons and print money. I think it helped me that I lost money in the beginning because I just saw the potential that it had and I got insta-hooked to the game. It was way more exciting than the other things that I do because I had direct influence on the actions that I take. I had the fire and the passion just to fight for it and I knew I was good at it. I wouldn't say I necessarily chose it as a, as a career, it just kind of happened, you know. I was making good money from it and I thought, okay, I'm just going to keep doing this. I enjoy it and it gives me a lot more freedom than any other job would. You need a lot of determination and if you really want to be successful in poker, you should just dedicate a lot of your time and take the chance. Try to soak in everything that you can and the success, it will just come by itself. The most amount I lost in a day is probably about two and a half K. That was a bad day. I was going through quite a bad phase of life at that point. I think that's the only reason I stayed at the table so long as to be able to lose two and a half K was I was just in a kind of a bad phase of mine. I was in a bad sleep pattern. I wasn't going to the gym. I wasn't eating very well. And uh, I was playing pretty bad poker. And the best thing to do if you were going through any kind of downswing is to take a break from poker for a few days, go out with your friends, try and have a social life, and then come back to poker when you're feeling a bit more refreshed. Yeah, now I'm like my own boss. I gotta do whatever I want. It just gives me like the freedom to do whatever I don't really have to work like long hours it's, which is really how I prefer like I prefer to like really try to kick ass for like, a short amount of time and, and kind of zen out the rest of it so plus like, I mean I like life I live I mean I, I do pretty good and you know it's it's like nice to live like this so I mean that's I guess my motivation just get a professional thinking as fast as possible be dedicated be passionate about what you do don't get frustrated and just look forward because there's a lot to get right now if you want to work at it i mean it's there for you